I remember the day that I dropped him off at the airport when he was going to Dubai. He gave me a hug and said, I'll be back in about five weeks. And that was the last time I saw him for many years. We had a great family life. We had five children and lived in the Park Forest, Illinois. There's thousands of stories of people trying to whatever, get out of POW camps, you're like, whatever, and they die. I went back to school and got my CPA certificate and went to work for a public accounting firm. Started my own practice in 1973. The stories started getting crazy, and I mean, you can't make that stuff up. The judge says, I have it from high authority that you will never be allowed to leave this country. There's only three outcomes here. He's either caught, he's gonna make it, or he's gonna die traveling in the crate. In early October, I built a crate, and it had to be in such a way that I could escape in case of an emergency. If Houdini can do it, I can do it. He's not just giving up to those people even if he dies today. He won't do it in the way they planned. I was so delirious. I had a, a little container with ice packs, which already had melted. I had a little tiny fan. I tried to get a drink of water. I couldn't find my mouth. I knew where it was supposed to be, but I couldn't find it. I was not sure that I was gonna survive this. Mm -hmm. 